Now it's time for the full-blown routine. This is exactly the way I do this trick on stage for a thousand people, strolling at a cocktail party for one or two people at a time, close-up room. It's very, very practical. Start clean, that's important. It's a little mystery, ladies and gentlemen, with a piece of white rope. Now, I must admit, for many years, I used to perform this mystery with two pieces of white rope, but then I realized nobody had any idea what I was doing. So now, for contrastular purposes, I use different colored ropes. It's a much better mystery. A lovely shade of red, so you will not confuse it with the white, or for those who may not be watching with a color set, dark and light. And it's the light rope you need to watch. Just make a loop, pass the end through the loop and pull. This, of course, gives me a knot. But this is a very special knot. This is known as the amazing acrobatic knot. The reason it's called that is all I've got to do is twirl the ropes together, then say the secret magic words, which I must say silently to myself. That causes the knot to jump off the white rope over to the red, which in itself is quite a feat, although I seem to be the only one who thinks so. Getting the knot to jump is relatively easy, but here's the hard part. Give it a squeeze like this, Turn it into a sliding knot because you can actually slide the knot right off the rope. In fact, completely off the other side like this. Now the hardest part is to hold the rope like this, the knot like that. Don't blink or you'll miss it. Watch the rope, watch the knot, right back on just like that. And if you have some magic dust, which conveniently enough I do, just reach into the pocket, get a little handful, just a little sprinkle, watch the knot. Oh, that turns it into a sliding knot again. I could slide it all the way down to here. And if I blow one last time, what that does is that fuse welds the rope and the knot together, dissolving them together as one. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the mystery of the acrobatic movement. Why not?